a woman has pleaded guilty to murder charges in the gruesome slaying of 19-year-old Marlon Ochoa Lopez, whose baby was cut from her womb in 2019. Desiree Figueroa, 29, pleaded guilty on Monday to one count of first-degree murder, according to Cook County court records. Figueroa has agreed to testify against her mother, Clarissa Figueroa, in exchange for a 30-year sentence. The Figueroas both had been indicted on multiple counts, including murder, kidnapping, dismembering a body, and concealing a homicide in the deaths of Ochoa Lopez and her baby, Giovanni Lopez. Last year, Clarissa Figueroa's boyfriend, Piotr Bobak, pleaded guilty to one count of obstruction of justice for helping cover up the murders. He was sentenced to four years in prison and given credit for the three years and eight months he had already spent in jail, so has already been released. Police and prosecutors have said not long after Clarissa Figueroa's own adult son died of natural causes, she told her family she was pregnant. They say she plotted for months to acquire a newborn and that she posted an ultrasound and photos of a room decorated for a baby on her Facebook page. In March 2019, she and Ochoa Lopez connected on a Facebook page for pregnant women. The two first met in person around April 1, 2019, when Ochoa Lopez went to the Figueroa's house. The teen returned three weeks later to accept Clarissa Figueroa's offer of free baby clothes, and as Desiree Figueroa was showing Ochoa Lopez a photo album of her late brother to distract her, Clarissa Figueroa sneaked up behind her and strangled her with a cord. Once Ochoa Lopez stopped showing signs of life, Clarissa Figueroa cut the baby from her womb with a butcher knife, and she and her daughter wrapped the teen's body in a blanket, put it in a plastic bag, and dragged it outside to a garbage can, according to prosecutors. Later that day, Clarissa Figueroa called 911 claiming that her newborn baby wasn't breathing. When first responders arrived, the child was blue. Clarissa, a former certified nursing assistant, passed the baby off as her own when she took him to Christ Medical Center, where he died two months later. Detectives investigating Ochoa Lopez's disappearance learned that she had gone to the Figueroa's home. Two weeks after her disappearance, police found her car parked nearby and were told by Desiree Figueroa that Clarissa Figueroa recently had given birth. DNA tests later determined the child was not Clarissa Figueroa's. Detectives later found Ochoa's body stuffed in a trash can at the Figueroa's home. About six months after Ochoa Lopez was killed, Desiree Figueroa gave birth in jail to her own child,